Hey guys, John here with the Ojai Vineyard. We're gonna be going over the 2016 John Sebastiano Syrah. This is always one of my favorite Syrahs that we make because it's so exuberant, so balanced, and so deep and rich and complex right out of the gate. You don't have to wait a long time for this wine to develop as you have to do with some of our other wines. Let's go over some of the characteristics of it. I mean, some of the, the winemaking characteristics. We made a huge production of 12 barrels, right? So super small production we made of this, not a lot at all. At harvest, it was around 3.4 pH or so. In the winemaking side, it has 15% new oak, but this is our new oak, which is usually three to four year aged wood, which gives you a lot less extraction and a lot more mellow of an oaky characteristic. Spent 17 months in those barrels and it was unfiltered, and unfine. Okay, so we really try not to manipulate this wine at all. We try to show the vineyard in that vintage rather than showing us with a heavy hand of winemaking. Comes from a very cool climate uh, called John Sebastiano, rotate, uh, located on the northeastern edge of Santa Rita Hills. Way up in the hills, right? High enough to get just blasted by the wind all day. That is absolutely essential for us trying to do what we want with this wine. So way up in the hills where it gets hit with the wind, it's going to slow down the ripening of the fruit. It's going to help maintain acidity in that wine. That acid is absolutely crucial because it's what's going to give that wine drive and flow and power across your palate. It's also what's going to make it fresh and lively on your palate as well. That's not to say this wine is light body because it's not. It's definitely on the medium to heavy side, but it's got that super strong acid and that acid is what's going to liven it up. It's also what's going to open up its pairing capabilities. So it gives you a really good broad range of ability to uh, eat foods with it. And that's part, again, why we like it. Uh, so let's look at the wine itself. The, the color of it is a nice deep ruby purple. Uh, the aroma, you get these bright exuberant flowers out of it, but it's not a light flower. It's more of a kind of a dense violet flower. Um, you also have more kind of a woodsy character in it. I, I love the woodsy character. I, ca I call it rustic character. That's kind of what Ojai Vineyard has in my mind, a very hallmark rustic-y character. It's almost like you're walking through the woods up in Big Sur or something in the morning where the pine needles are kind of dewy on the ground and you crush them and you feel this light spritz almost of, of pine and resin in your face. That's what this wine has. It also has a fruit core. So it's got this black kind of raspberry core surrounded by that rustic-y pine needle and flower uh, aroma. So in the flavor, you definitely have raspberry. It's a dark raspberry fruit, uh, but it's it also has that pepper, earth, smoke, spice, and even some mushroomy character. So it's hunkered down by the fruit with all these more unique characteristics around it. it makes it a lot of fun. It really opens it up to those pairing capabilities. Um, medium body, as I said, light in alcohol, it's only 13%. Cool climate wines are great at that. A light alcohol, high acid gives it fresh, bright, exciting power, uh, and it gives a really good balance to the wine. So hopefully you enjoy this wine as much as we do. Again, that's the 2016 John Sebastiano Syrah.